Uh, we've got the team together. We've got a new guy. We've got a new guy. His name is Alex. Como esta Alex? Todo bien, gracias a Dios. <laughs> he said he's very well. Thank you. Thanks to God. Yes, yeah, so we got Abraham, we got Alex, and we got Jenny. Yeah. And uh, got my sorry face. <laughs> uh, we are here in the city doing mission today. We've uh, we've already given out over a hundred pieces of bread. I think uh, not just bread, but bread with cheese. You know, tasty bread, bread made with maize, different ingredients. You know, something a bit more nutritious than just bread. So uh, yeah, we are here, and uh, let's get going. Oye, se nos ha entrado un toro a la casa. Mira, se mi chango y está queriendo cobrar la porque se ve el mismo. ¡Qué animalango, oye! Mira, si la haya quebrado el vidrio, Dios mío. Oye, qué cosanga. Guacho, guacho. Falchurraco. Ahí va la diaga escapando, escape. So today is the day we are starting putting walls up to the ceiling. Uh, so that would be with a similar window here, there'll be a similar one above, and these walls on the sides uh, will be going up. It's exciting. Um, this is on the upper level. I'm on the upper level up as we speak. Uh, once they've gone up, um, we will be pushing the putting the scaffolding down the bottom there and rendering on the outside as well and yeah really exciting so a lot of us are up ladders today uh, we put in the rebar for this end section the rebar is just to tie in the bricks uh, as we're going to finish pushing up these columns all the way out to the top and beautiful sunny day we've got Bono up there harnessed up and we've strapped on the soldering machine. So I say soldering machine because in, in Spanish they call it a soldering machine. In English it's welding. Uh, the walls on the upper level are going up. As you can see, we've got scaffolding in place. Uh, if I move over here, we are lifting up by in buckets. And yeah, it's going up. I'm going to show you guys from the outside. Well, that's from the outside. The sun is really blinding the camera at the moment. There you go, that's the sun. Uh, but it's a beautiful day. I'll move a bit more in this section. You can start to see how it's... There you go, that's lighting is a bit better. Start to see how it's coming up at the top. So that's really good news. We're protecting our doors at the bottom. It's falling bits of debris there as well. Oh, you can hear the little one. Look at that! So we got two new baby lambs. I knew they were going to be delivered yeah. soon. And you're a beautiful lamb, aren't you? Are you beautiful? Yes, you are. You're quite furry. Maybe you'll have more fur than your mummy. That's good you got fur. Oh, you're weird. That's a really good sign. That means you're healthy. The other one also weird. Did she? Oh. <laughs> so we're in the centre, we're on the upper level and we have Nicola up there who is uh, building walls up towards the roof which is amazing. Uh, we get the windows in once we've rendered and painted and that'll stop the rain coming in so we're really excited about that. That's the other side. Uh, I'll zoom out a little bit and give you a slightly different perspective. Wide screen zoom. Yeah, so it's really, really exciting. We had some other news today as well. Uh, we'll be sharing other news as well. There we go, behind me. That makes the hole smaller already, so less rain can get in. Um, but obviously, we're, we can't wait to fill that gap and uh, stop the rain coming in completely. Are you enjoying your new swing, your news? Really nice. I'm in the sky. <laughs> wow. We've got that view in the background. 
and we're on the side of the centre we've changed where the swings are we've been up on the ladder you're going to try that one, you're going to swap because one's slightly higher than the other that's the other swing yeah I'll push you So this hole is for all the kitchen drainage from both kitchens, we've got two kitchens, uh, one's the bakery and the big sort of com big kitchen area really, it's, it's, it's over there on the left, it's our, it was our first place that we had with a roof on, that was where we were able to cook in, and the other kitchen is in the centre, it's, more, it's a smaller kitchen, more for general items, but the people that will cook for the kids will be cooking in, in the other kitchen in that one. And this is a big hole because we're putting the drainage system in here. There's going to be a grey water system in here, which we'll be uh, building over the next few weeks. So we're in the city and it's early in the morning, it's a, it's a Saturday and there's, there's quite a lot of kids and young adults as well, sleeping rough and dancing in the street at traffic lights and so we are, well I'm on my own today, I'm going to go and give them breakfast. So I'm walking down the main avenue in in the city with breakfast for a load of homeless people that I saw. It's a mixture of young adults I think and a disabled person. Uh, I just gave breakfast to three kids that were dancing in the street. They're new kids, I just met them, I didn't I didn't film them. But yeah, so a day I wasn't coming to do mission but you see people in need and you just have to stop and help. You you, you just can't go past like you don't carry on with what you're doing, you stop and help the person in need. Um, when you can, sometimes you can't, sometimes it's hard to stop, hard to park and all of that business but, but other days everything is possible. So we're here in, the, in El Torno in the plaza, in the main plaza and here in the tree we have a sloth 
in the plaza, can you believe it? That is unbelievable, I've never been that, that far close to the sloth. Very slow moving sloth. Uh, those of, anyone that's been here and visited us can see which part of the plaza we're in. <laughs> it's quite amazing. early morning in the market uh, we came today to do evangelism we are here with Isa almost ready to start Hello. <laughs> Abraham tonight. How you doing Abraham? Como esta? <laughs> Very good, good, good. And we are streets, finding the kids in the streets. <laughs> These kids are doing their homework on the top of the car. Their parents are trying to sell stuff in the street. Like we are walking down the main avenue in Bolivia. This road used to be a dirt road many years ago. And now it's four or five lanes locked through. It's a huge junction in Bolivia. We spotted some kids, some teenagers in this junction. Uh, a lot of them begging or washing windows, trying to get money. And uh, we're going to go and see them. See how we can help. We've already given one food out of the window of the car. So they're over there. That side. Today Amelia is doing the bread. Is that this is your first bread? Are you doing? I mean, yeah. Oh, that's great. That's okay. good. So explain Sour to us. Sourdough bread. Sourdough oh, bread. Yeah. What do you put in it? We put some garlic oil, some sesame. Because you can see the black little sesame seeds. Yeah. Good. And some starch. Mmm. That's great. And that is my dough. Great. Look at that. Well done, you. Super. And say so this is the rescue of my bread. So we're in a rural area. It's about an hour drive from our centre. There's a school here, and on the edge of the school, there's a family living in a mud house. And they've got three kids. One's outside having a bath in a in a tub. Well, I wanted to show you some of the where we are. We're in the countryside. Like everyone's like farmer here, and people are very poor. The school is looks okay but that's because it's been built by authorities and 